This video is for researchers who already use the free SSH client called PuTTY to log into the Institute for Cyberscience Advanced Cyber Infrastructure, or ICSACI for short. If you're not familiar with PuTTY and you'd like to learn how to use it to log into ICSACI, please see our training video, Log In with PuTTY. Note that PuTTY currently is available only for Windows systems. If you're using a Mac, see our training video, Log in with SSH. Begin by starting PuTTY. To do this, go to the Start menu on your PC and click on PuTTY. In the PuTTY window, you're prompted to specify the host name of the machine you want to connect to. For archive storage, type datamgr.aci.ics.psu.edu. Then go to the Saved Sessions field and type archive underscore storage. Click Save. Now, click Open. You may see an alert box asking you to confirm that you trust this host. Click Yes. When you start the session, the terminal opens and you're asked for your username. Enter your Penn State username and press Enter. You also need to enter your password to log in. Notice that the cursor doesn't move as you type the password. When you enter your password, a notification gets sent to the Duo Push app on your smartphone. Approve the request. Now you're logged into the system. Here's how to view the list of files on your system. To access the archive storage, type cd archive forward slash. Then press Enter. You are now in your archive storage. Use the ls command to view the list of files in your archive. So that's how to access your archive storage on the ACI system using PuTTY. For more ICS ACI training videos, please visit our website, ics.psu.edu.